built a secret underwater bunker in Rust, perfect for hiding juicy loot. But would it fool any unsuspecting raiders that attempt to raid my basic looking 2x2? Let's find out. Alright team, we're back. I've just spawned into the server. Today I'm playing duo, maybe solo at some point, with plans to build a secret underwater bunker base. The server wiped like two days ago, so we're all late to wipe, but nothing crazy. I've got quite a few BPs, actually mostly just tier 3 BPs, but either way, it shouldn't be too bad of a start. I'm going to wait until daytime, then probably farm the road on the way to my teammate. But yeah, I I'm also not really sure where we're putting this base down yet. We're going to kind of figure that out as we go, but yeah, it should be a fun one. Alright, I got a hundred and forty scrap. I'm gonna stash this. Oh, don't come at me, piggy. Nice throw. Oh, you see that? <laughs> yeah. Uh, you gonna take this also? Big. There's a man on a horse west. Hit him once, he's ready. I'm dead, no idea where from. Dead? Nice. Oh my shit. Loaded? Yep. Big. Okay, since we actually have a lot of shit to store now, I think I'm gonna farm up a base and just put a starter somewhere, I don't know, somewhere near my stash probably. Hey guys, while I farm for the base, I wanted to take a moment to say that if you've made it this far in and you enjoy the content, please consider dropping a sub, like, or comment. I'm nearing 500 subscribers and it means the world to me if you could help me reach that milestone. Thanks again, and I really hope you enjoy. Okay, so I had something come up and had to go AFK for several hours after building the base, but I'm back now. It's pretty late at night and my duo's logged off to go to bed, so I'll be solo for the rest of today. We did end up getting more than enough scrap for a tier 2 after he recycled from the guy he killed at Oxum's. So I'm going to craft and place that workbench now and then probably go get a blue card from Harbor. Wait, what the fuck? Hey, not bad. Bro is just standing in the middle of harbor for no reason. Where's this bow? There it is. Okay, so I have quite a few comps, so I think I'm going to take like half of these, maybe a little more than half, and go recycle. I wouldn't mind getting some BPs on tier 2, uh, especially building BPs, just to make it easier when I do the bunker. So I I'm probably going to take these just to Oxums and recycle, and then I might do just a little bit of ocean farming after that for more scrap. I don't really have any like insane monuments nearby, unfortunately. So I think that's probably my best route unless I hit like a rig or something since I do have blue card. I could run for a red, but I think that's pretty heavily contested at the moment. Four hundred and seventy scrap is really not bad. I also totally forgot I actually do have garage door in some of the building already, so I think I'm gonna get to Molotov. I've seen quite a few bases that still have wood doors, and I think some of them are probably worth the gamble. I mean, I have a neighbor right next door even that's decaying. That's a wood door that I think would be worth it. So I'm gonna do some ocean farming and just get a little bit more scrap, and then probably do some, at least some Molly raids after that, if not actual raids.
people really sleep on ocean farming, man. I've been, like, granted, it is a little bit of, like, a bitch boy way out. I won't lie. It's safe. But, like, I was out there for nine and a half minutes, got a hundred raw scrap in inventory of comps. Like, if you just need, like, comps in particular or a little bit of scrap to, like, finish getting, like, one, one thing on tech tree or something, it's totally worth it. Okay, we've got our first garage door down. We're a little bit safer. Let's get Molly this door. I, I don't really expect to get anywhere with this, to be totally honest and fully clear. I think this is an absolute waste of low grade. Um, it's probably going to be a sheet door past this. And if it is, that's fine, because it's decaying. I could, like, rock the stone wall or something, but I'd kind of rather bang my head against the wall than throw a rock against this one. So, if this doesn't work, we're just going to wait for it to decay. Yep, it's sheet. Just like I thought. Now, it is a wood wall, though. I mean, we could break the wood wall, but I just, I don't think it's, I don't know. I'm not going to spend that amount of time or that amount of low grade when the spec here is 25 health. So... Yeah, we'll just let it decay. I mean, I'm tempted to come back with pickaxes, but I'll just let it decay. Guys, I'm just out here farming, minding my own business, and check this out. Check out what I just stumbled upon. A little bunker base for the wood door. I, I think I'm probably going to depot farm and come back and raid this before the night's over. I'm, I'm going to be logging off for the night soon, but that could be easy money. I don't know. Let's find out. Guys, I just depoted my farm, and as I was driving back up to my home, I noticed that my neighbor's base decayed. So let's go see if the waste of low grade was worth it, or if he was super poor. Eh? Not a, not a bad sign so far. Hey! 200 free scrap? That's not bad. That's, that's totally worth one molly wasted. Okay, with the curiosity of the neighbor's base resolved, let's go raid that bunker base. Hopefully this is a come up, dude. I just, I want a big win. Alright, anything? Not a good sign. Definitely not a good sign. Uh... Oh, fuck. I only brought one molly, too. Um, okay, I, I might come back and break TC. I don't know. I'm pretty tired. I don't know. Honestly, dude, I'm probably just going to build up the base and go to bed. Like, I'm so tired. I don't even care at this point. I just want to go to bed. Good morning, guys. I've just logged on. My duo's been on for probably about an hour now. Um, I think we're going to start the morning by going to find a boat, probably. Our boat, as I understand it, was stolen earlier today, and we, we really need that because we're kind of landlocked where we are, and this isn't where we're going to put the water base. So, yeah, we need to go find a build spot, and then we also need it to go get farm and things, because we are super dry on farm where we're at now, so. Farm? Nice. Oh, kind of juice. Grab that kit. Uh, Alright, well, I guess I'm going to depot this and then we look for a boat.
We just ran right by a man, and he just died right there. So I'm wondering if it's like this base, and he's gonna go to his roof or some shit. Because he ran right by me. There's no shot he didn't see me. Is that a boat? 20? Uh, it looks like it. Fuck that man. I'm taking it. Uh, somebody in front of the, yeah, I see him. Over the boat. Oh, he sees us too. Yeah, door just opened to the right. There's two. He oh, called us yeah. out. There's another guy right here. There's a... You see him? There's so many. He's trying to torch for him. Yep. Holy fuck, I whiffed. I don't have meds. Alright, I killed him naked. Oh. One's playing rock close. Twice. I don't really have the ammo. Hit the hit one. It's like right on top of the rock. Skyline again, bitch. I hit a couple twice, three times. Killed one. Nice. How many were there? Three. Killed the other? Oh my god, that was my last bullet. No, 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 I'm stuck. I'm stuck with fucking nothing. Another one, two, three. Hold up, he's out of his base. Dead again. Son, grab that Tommy and all this. Is there just one Tommy? Yeah. No, okay. the others are just bows. Okay. Had a little bit of ammo on my body, but nothing too. Dipping on boat. I'm outie. All right, so after we got the boat back, we ended up just taking it on a bunch of farm trips. Um, nothing really important happened. I didn't record any of that, uh, just because it's usually very boring just to go farm. Um, but I did at one point end up dying to a cheater, which, you know, it's not necessarily unexpected if we are playing face punch. But we do know there's a cheater roaming that side of the map now. Um, here's a little bit of the farm. There's still a little bit more spread around, like TC here. Uh, I think there's probably some in a backpack as well. Um, but we're going to do a little bit of organizing and then go start building the water base. Okay, so you place the first foundation at water level. Build out until you can't anymore. Drop down a foundation. One more foundation. And then this is where the bunker starts. No. <clears throat> okay, so we have the starter 2x2 two two down and the bunker's pretty much ready to transfer loot into. Uh, the base needs some upgrades, but we want to quickly just kind of get a feel for the area. Uh, we moved into one of the busier areas we've been able to find. Uh, both rigs are just off the coast of where we've built. Um, so there's been quite a few people around here, but I just want to explore for a few and see uh, kind of how many people are around here, how active it is, what bases are here, that kind of thing. Are you chopping trees? Nope. Someone's chopping trees up here. Perfect. Wait, I hear him. He's on me. 
Is that what he has? Mm -mm. I think I saw a wolf heading above the ridge, but that's it. He's deceased. Might be another. Wait, I'm coming from behind. Oh, he's juice. Grab the rest. Yeah, Tommy. Is this name Kit? No, it wasn't. It was. Oh, sh I'm dead to AK. Oh, shit. It's the guy that just killed me. Or that I just killed. Okay, well, so we have AK neighbors. That's, that's a good sign. Uh, I guess that guy was building a main base or something. There's some smaller bases on that coast. Um, so we're going to have to investigate and figure out which one of those is his. Because that could be an easy come up raid for money. Uh, and Jesse there just died as well. <laughs> um, okay. Oh well. Uh, I didn't even get a bag in the base apparently. So I'm going to I guess. I'm going to just spawn over at the old base. Transfer loot. And then I'll show you guys how the bunker works sometime after that I suppose. Okay, so I've once again done a ton of off-camera farming. Um, we've made a shitload of satchels, so we're going to take a portion of those and go raid this 2x1 that the AK guy came out of. Um, I'm going to play ground. Jacito's going to perch up on one of these zip lines and just kind of do overwatch. So once he gets up there, I'm just going to start booming. We should definitely get counters in this area, though, so I think this will probably draw out some names we haven't seen before. Yeah, yeah. Should be chill. Okay. I'm going to start chunking. This probably did not bring seal mats unless they got him. Alright. Nice. Insane satchels. Move loot. Nothing in there. There's some shit in here. I'm gonna blow his TC just to double check, but there's a lot of signs in here and I don't know what they say. They're in another language. A lot of char in the TC. Actually, kind of needed that. Uh, the guy running from northeast with the tower line. That's you? Yeah, I killed him. He spawned in and tried to close to your garage door. Uh, there's there's another one running. That one? Or is there another? No, uh, there's still another one. He's about to come over the ridge. Geared or naked? Geared. Okay. Thing has that. He's like right in front of me, east. I'm about to bounce with the goods. You think I can? No, and uh, he's he's coming up on you. Okay. He's running down the hill. He's dead. It's another guy far east. I can't loot him. I'm gonna depot and go loot his shit. All right. Well, that guy clearly moved loot, but at least we'll get the charcoal we need to make more GP, and I can make more satchels to raid uh, his other base, hopefully. Um, and, I mean, we'll get the kits out of the counters as long as we can get this home as well, so it's not a total loss. Coming back. Hit twice. Where's Python? Three times. Uh, power line, middle. Okay. You're like right in front of you. Once. Dead. Nice. Did you kill the other guy? Or no? Or is this the only one? Oh. Crossbow. Uh, I think that was... Did you loot the first, Tessie? You're on it down. now, okay. Uh, jump rat. 
Oh, Junior Rat or whatever? Junior X Rat, yeah. That's the guy, yeah. I guess that's his team, which means we are probably a target now. All right, guys, so I haven't really done much since the last raid, except for smelt sulfur and make gunpowder and craft satchels. Um, I have enough for one stone wall, and we've got like a one shot to hit this right on dude's new base and hope we get AK sets or whatever the fuck he has in there. So we're just gonna throw these satchels and hope for the best. Yeah. Fuck me, dude. Either we just hit the wrong wall or he's moved again. I mean, garage door is going to be TC. The other one's dropped down, but I don't know if I want to farm up the satchels to hit it, to be honest. Guys, 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 we're in the middle of something here. Uh, I was just closing up base and getting ready to show you the bunker before I get off for the night, and I heard a raid really close to where our old base was. So I grabbed a DB, put out some bags, and came over here, and now I'm inside the raid just waiting to see if the raiders come back. So... I'm going to sit here for like five and maybe ten minutes and see if they come back for more loot and just see what happens from there. Right above us. I hit one a lot. Come in. One's full yeah. dead. Hit the other one, but I'm dead. Yeah. I'm running up from an outer bag. Maybe I can get a gun before he heals or something. Fuck me. Alright guys, we're going to finally take a look at this bunker as I close up the base for the night. So if you go through this window, you can drop down underwater. And we have these vending machines. I've transferred some loot down here. I'm still transferring the rest. Um, it's nothing, you know, we didn't have a super crazy day. Most of the raids were major flubs, to be totally honest. But we have decent loot down here. It's, it's Like I said, it's not crazy, but it's not bad. Um, I need to put a couple more vending machines up, uh, but once you go up, we just pick up this ladder, we'll place a floor here, and I need, I already have them, so we can place furnaces on top of that, perfect, okay, so just leave like a bunch of shitty loot upstairs, but just make sure it doesn't look like loot was moved when you do this. I like to just kind of spread around just a little bit of a random uh, metal just in case someone were to raid. It looks like it's actually utilized because once you place this window, you can't see the floor. It's like the floor just doesn't exist there. So most people won't see it. I've done this once or twice before. Uh, I've never been raided and someone catch the bunker when I do this, but you never know. Maybe you'll get a smart raider. Maybe you don't. I'm probably going to let the base sit for a couple days at this point and just see if anyone raids it see what happens like see if they catch the bunker i don't know so i'm gonna let this sit maybe a day or two and we'll check back in and see what happens guys unfortunately i let the base sit for a couple nights and no one raided it so i didn't get to see the bunker stand up in a raid um i ended up giving it away to this very nice man named big unk that was offline the night before here's a very short snippet of his response to it Anyway, I hope you all enjoyed the video. If you did, please consider dropping a like, a sub, maybe a comment. I appreciate each and every single one of you for watching this far, and I really hope to see you for the next one.